Hi and welcome to Unreal Engine Tutorial. Uh, now I'm going to launch the system, but if you don't have this launch here, you may have a download. Click on the download and that will take some time for it to download. But if you have this launch, all you need to do is click on it and let's wait for the system to. Now the system is ready for it. Here we have a uh, now the system is ready and here are the previous project that I created earlier. But right in here we have the blueprint and we have the C++ tab. Okay, with the C++ tab, as you can see, it says the template offer a good example of how to work with some of the code concept of the engine from the code, okay? You still have to have the option to add your own blue blueprint if you want but if you decide to choose this C++ tab you must make sure you have Visual Studio at least 2015 installed I think I have 2000 I have 2017 installed on this system although you don't have to be worried if you don't have Visual Studio installed on your system you can always use the blueprint and for the, today's tutorial, I'm going to be using the blueprint anyway, so I'll click on the blueprint. And right here, we have some preset games. Okay, for the blueprint that I'm going to be using, if you guys have a look at it, it says the blueprint template required no programming knowledge. All game machine can be implemented using the blueprint visual scripting. Each template include a basic set of blueprint to use as a starting point for your game so you have no problem guys all you need to do is let's select any of this template but for now i'm going to go for this first person shooter or if you guys want you can choose any of these you select you should see the sample of what you want to play around with this it's advisable you have a go at it just play around with it and just learn from there take it from there or you can always go for the blank if you're confident enough but as for me i'm going to go for the first person shooter right here first person so for the first person i'll now come to this part of it you see right down here so but if you decide to read up here you see what is written there that you can choose some setting for your project don't worry you can change those later and the target hard, uh, hardware section of the project okay so i'm going to just choose this desktop let's choose desktop right there and here where we have maximize quantity or quality i'm going to choose maximize quality and here um with starter content i'm going to choose that and here let's give our project a name i'll just call it first person there that's the name of my project and underneath you should see the button that say create project okay you can see that create your new project in the specified location with the specified template name okay so i'm just going to click there say create so it's now creating my project and right here guys we have my first person Okay, look at it first in example map right there if you guys have a good look at it you will see right there let's move it in let's bring it in there you can see that it has first person template okay you do that by just using the the wheel on your mouse okay you can use it to move forward and backwards and use the right mouse to pin it around just to move around the the template okay so you can also just play around with this first person itself let's extend this so that you guys can see the player button right there you click on that and you can just do what you like with it so shoot with your mouse you see that let's come up here Just move around by moving your mouse around.
Okay, guys. So to end this, you can just click on the pause button there, or you just press the escape key there.